Hey, welcome to Wagwan Apps, and today we're going to look at um, how to install more customized watch faces. So, by default, what you do is to get a watch face on your on your watch. For example, you go to the Play Store, you search for the you search for a list of watches, and you can see there's loads. So, for example, my search criteria is Android watch face. Android Wear watch faces or watch face and you get a whole list right and you can install them and once they're installed on your on your on your phone you can browse to them using the Android Wear app for example here and you can see a list of watch faces okay but there are some apps where you can have more detailed or you the, they have a basic watch face like Watchmaster, and I'm gonna do a quick demo of Watchmaster because it's one of my favorites, um, and that's because some of the watch faces and the level of quality on the watch faces are is amazing. So, for example, I'm gonna activate Watchmaster now. Now, Watchmaster is live. You can see the watch face has changed to some digital kind of display, right? Okay, I hope you guys can see that. Yeah, you can. So. But then, when you go to when you go to Watchmaster, the Watchmaster app, you can see they've got hundreds and hundreds of designs. Some are, some are free, and some you have to buy. Okay, so you can see there's loads. So people are allowed people have, you know they probably become publishers or whatever. Um, there's lots of categories. For example, you can see loads of categories. And this is now probably my favorite watch faces app. And I actually didn't know about this until one brethren I know. Um, up in the north goes to me have you ever tried watchmaster and he's actually got on hawaii w1 which is a sick watch although it costs a lot it is an amazing watch um so look this watchmaster app has loads and loads of diff different kinds of app look at the higher there's a higher resolutions category for example so if we have a look at ones i have already installed so if i go to my watches you can see i have blue lagoon blue moon i was gonna say blue lagoon but uh blue moon okay let's have a quick look at blue moon Bring it closer so you can have a good look. Okay, so remember this is an LG Urbane W150, um, and that's Blue Moon running on that. Um, and that is I saw I saw this on the Hawaii W1 on my mate's watch, and it looked wicked. And I was like, bro, where did you get that face from? He goes, you need to get a Watchmaster, bro. You need to get Watchmasters. So I was like, sick. So I got Watchmaster, um, and even in ambient mode, watch it go to ambient mode. Wait for it. Wait for it. There. You can get a full full display. Uh, like I said, I'm not a bit of big fan of a minim, minim, minimalized uh, ambient mode display. I hate it because it it doesn't really reflect what the watch is supposed to do in the watch. It makes the watch less realistic. So I want my watches to always have a full um, full display like this in ambient mode. And they talk about battery usage and blah blah blah. It drains more battery, but in my opinion. It's not that bad, honestly. I mean, this watch will last two days in full ambient mode uh, and full regular you know, usage constantly being connected to my phone. It will last easy two days, okay? And this is an LG Airbane. My G-Watch R lasts that long easily as well. Um, so don't worry about, you know, running it in a minimalized, in, in a more simplified way. Um, so like here with, with these watch faces, you can go to the customization for the watch and you can say, okay, I want my ambient watch face to be only grey okay so you can see it demos it on the app and now if I go back to the watch you can see you can see there now watch it go to ambient mode and this is what I love about Watchmaster as well because some some of the Google, uh, Google Play Store ones you can't do that they just go to some lame simplified mode so look so it goes into now a grey kind of more black and white right so that means in standby it's always going to be displayed like that but I'd like I said I'd love, rather have the full on display Okay, um, if I say hours and minutes, you can see it will make the watch display. And you can see the watch changing as I do it. Simple analog, simple digital, right? Watch the watch. You can see the watch changing in the background, right? But I always go for full on. Give me the full display, please. I don't like anything else, right? Which is pretty sick. And you could do that with all of their watch faces. And they have, and I've got some really, really nice ones installed which suit this watch so badly. Let's look at Bumblebee. For example, <clears throat> was it downloading it? Okay, download it, son. There you go. So Bumblebee's live. So let's have a look at Bumblebee close up. Yeah, how cool is that? I love that. That looks pretty sick. Kind of sporty. Kind of sporty as well, right? Kind of Formula One style watch. Uh, and it's running in full ambient mode as always. Like I said, I try and keep them all in full ambient mode. Um, but that looks pretty sick too. And 
Look at that, yeah, I like that. Uh, what else do we have? So these are from the high race category, I think most of them. Uh, Dark Sheik is my favourite, but I'm going to show you that at the end. So you can have digital ones like I showed you before. It's got weather related information, so you can watch it change on the watch. There you go. Another close up of that. Yeah, so. Um, so Watchmaster is pretty sick. Now, a lot of these fancy ones, you have to pay for them, right? So this is one of my favourites. I discovered this recently, right? Because I think it looks amazing on this watch. How about that? How sick does that look? <laughs> that That is probably one of my best watch faces for this watch from, um, from uh, Watchmaster. Now, with Watchmaster, you have a few options, okay? You can... Buy a one off. You can pay a one off fee to have unlimited access forever. You can you can see get pro uh, or so or you can pay. Um, what was it six? It was six ninety nine for one year. So I thought I'd try it for one year first and see how it goes. Or you can individually, like for example, look at this one. The heads up. Um, you can individually buy it. Uh, if you don't have a subscription already, you can individually just pay two two pound, two dollars or whatever it is for this watch face. For example. Um, look, so they've got velocity. I've even got velocity actually. Let's have a look. Apply. There you go. Watch the watch switch over. Hopefully. Let's give it a sec. Chamal, Chamal, watch it. I'm sure I've got velocity installed. If you don't have it installed, what happens is it says, you can see it says downloading, so it's doing something. It's just downloading the watch face to the watch. Um, I thought I had it already installed, but I guess I didn't. So we'll just wait for that. So like I said, there's so much variety on Watchmaster, but the quality, the level of quality on Watchmaster is pretty sick. There you go, have a quick closer look. You can see that, there you go. So um, watch it go into ambient mode. Let's see, what, I'm not sure what settings are on this watch face. But ambient mode, here it goes, here it goes. So it's on black, it's on grayscale. But you can see it still looks pretty good in ambient mode, right? So that's that. I mean, Watchmaster has loads and loads of watch faces and most of them are of a top quality look they've got the top watch faces that you can download i mean i don't think i've got any of the top ones but there's new updates there's blah 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 so the way this works like i said is you have to go to the android wear app you have to obviously download watchmaster first and once you do it here you have to make sure that this watch face is set watchmaster is on once watchmaster is on then you can configure it separately from the app you know, a little bit more, extra, few extra steps, but it's worth it in the end. I mean, these are the watch faces I have at the moment. Yeah. Um, there are other apps that do something similar, such as, where is it gone? Watchmaker, which allows you to basically create your own watch. If you feel a little inventive or imaginative, you can come in here and design your own watch and upload it and blah, 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 um, which is pretty good. Um, but I'm not really into that. I'd rather look, let the professionals make it. People that are really good at it and let them do that um, and use their watch faces if they let me. So, I mean, Watchmaker's got loads of options, loads of um, things to do. And you can, like I said, you can go here and say, I would like to make my own watch. Design your watch. You see that? So, um, that's it. But I would say if you're not into that, Watchmaster is, is the sickest Thanks to the brother up north for mentioning it to me. But um, I would go with Watchmaster for more specific stuff. Otherwise, yeah, if it's too complicated for you, stick with the ones on Google Play. Some of them are pretty sick as well, like the Rich Face uh, ones and stuff like that. Anyway, thanks for watching. Hit up the messages. Make sure you subscribe for latest updates on Wagwan apps. And I will catch you guys later. Peace out.